so now you have studied some of the facilities in applying automated skill factors to AutoCAD drawings. So now let's study another resource to facilitate your drafting work, Creating Styles. Style creation applies to defining user-selected settings to meet users' needs. You can even create a style based on the currently sketched drawing. There are several applicable items in an AutoCAD drawing, which accept style settings, for example dimensions, leaders, texts and tables. These styles can be saved as templates to define plotting mode and layer settings. Then, whenever you work on a specific kind of drawing, for example a household electric layout, you just need to open that specific template. You can even create different dimension styles for each specific need. Define the dimension style settings for different existing technical standards. Also create style variations, such as adding more tolerance, increased precision in dimensions and other related aspects on dimensioning. In text, you can create styles used for legends, dimensions, bill of material tables and many other elements. There are several available table styles registered. You can even use an existing table to create a new style. Now in part list tables, to complement the table, you can create leader styles to help identify each item displayed on the defined part list style. After defining the settings for these styles, create commonly used layers and save these properties in a template. This will really facilitate your design work. In this class you have studied the advantages of creating styles with different elements in your AutoCAD drawing. You have also learned about using templates to sketch your drawings, save to this setting to make your work quicker and easier.